tonight we will fly above the hey guys welcome back to my channel if you are a returning subscriber and if you are a new subscriber welcome i am super happy to have you here where have you been have you hit that subscribe button yet anyways on today's episode i'm sharing with you my packing tip or just pack with me on a road trip i'm going for a five days trip and i'm using road and um, this is what i am taking along with me first and foremost it's very important for me to keep my heart in shape i don't want my heart to change shape so the first thing i do is to bring out all my clothing i will be using on the trip once i do that i then get my hat and try to like fix the hat in the middle of the suitcase oh and before i forget i'm actually going with a 6 kg suitcase and is um rucksack a little rucksack that's all so i don't want this hat to lose shape i want it to stay in this shape so what i do is just to put it in the middle of the suitcase once I do that, I then fold my clothing underneath of it and then my undies in the middle. So I just have to put all my undies together into my bra. And, I mean, sorry if you didn't want to hear that. And then put it in the middle of my um, my hat. The reason is because I don't want the, the head part of the hat, the whole part of the hat, to also have the wrong shape after I have unpacked this um unpacked my uh, my suitcase so of course you go with your 90s i always like to go with scarves then i go with a swimsuit because i know that perhaps or most likely i'll go to the beach or i'll go swimming i mean in the pool so basically it was quite an easy pack nothing serious nothing so difficult and this suitcase is quite small it wasn't big and then the next thing i do is to make sure that the top of the hat is also aligned with clothing so that it will keep that straightness for the hat and the hat does as its own bend so i'm done packing this is all i'm going to you know go out with for six days how am i going to do this don't worry i'm going to show you the rest of the content as time goes on and then you know how i am able to use just these clothes for six days or for five days so guys um the next thing is for my um my toiletries i just put them underneath i don't put them inside the the suitcase so if you have like a transparent um paper bag or a transparent ziplock or something you can always put them in ziplock but i didn't want to i just wanted to pack them this way reason is because i felt if i start packing them into ziplocks it would be a bit um clum not clumsy to be a bit um puffy so i just had to put them underneath my suitcase underneath my suitcase um cover basically like, <laughs> like this yeah basically so this is what i do and then the next thing i just zip up and ready to hit the streets anyways i'm going to show you also how i was able to pack my rock sack which has the basic things i will need while on the trip on the road so of course i just have to put in all the things i need my um identity cards Whatever I think I need, if I need a wallet, I put it here, but I just keep money somewhere around. And of course, I like to go out with like paracetamol, something for headaches sometimes, because road trips sometimes can be very stressful. And I have my hand cream there, I have my SPF there, my nose mask, of course, and um, COVID is still out there, and one has to be very, very careful. So um, let's get into the rest of the video, guys. Hey guys, so I'm ready to take um, my Uber down to where I'm going to get my bus to travel. One of the most important things you should take along when you're going on a road trip is tissue. So I don't know what you're going to use this for, but I definitely do know that you need it on a road trip. And also sunglasses. So another thing you should always have, maybe depending on the weather, it's your face cap it's very important because you need to shade yourself from sun always go out with your spf as well whenever you're going out to um for a road trip or for any long distance trip so guys um, i'm about to step out it's just about um 4 40 a.m and um wish me safe trip and let's get to see the rest of the journey but before i get to leave where do you think I am going to? Can you guess the country or the states? Oh, 
where do you think i'm going to do let me know in the comment section and let's enjoy the rest of the video i just love the sanity that comes with lagos when there is no traffic the peace and quiet can never be explained i just want to you know enjoy it wind my glass down and just enjoy the air because it's different a day before this trip i was in traffic for over four hours my legs were actually shaking and i felt so terrible and i just wish something can be done to, you know about lagos to bring the peace and quiet even the places like lekki is one where you think that it could be you know residential and quiet they are not quiet it's all noisy and commercial it's really really tiring gosh i just wish you can just carry my bag and finally say goodbye to lagos i hope soon well i'm still here don't mind me anyways guys um enjoy the rest of the video as i head to get my boss hey guys so i came to this hotel because i wanted to see the Say yes, they're going to pass for the meantime. time. As they come out of the garden. It's very nice place. So I'm good. I'm set for this trip. Let's go. 